The Duro species was first introduced to Star Wars in the Moss Eisley Cantina in A New Hope. Today we'll be talking about their biology, society, and more. There isn't much information at all about them in canon, so I'll be using mostly legend sources for this discussion, but I'll try to keep it to details I think are likely still true. The Duros were a humanoid species from the planet Duro in the galaxy's core. Their appearance was similar to that of classic green-skinned, large-eyed aliens from old sci-fi films. And that's literally all that's canon about them, so let's move on to legends. Along with their usually green or blue skin, they also had green blood. Their sense of smell came from olfactory organs underneath their eyes. The entire species was descended from reptiles, so they laid eggs to reproduce. They were born in a larval grub stage. The Duros were among the first people in the galaxy to become a spacefaring civilization. It was rumored that they had photographic memories making them excellent explorers and charters. Their hyperspace routes were some of the oldest in the galaxy, and many of them were still in use during the Imperial Era. Their homeworld was mostly uninhabited thanks to massive pollution, but it was covered with automated farms for food production that sustained 20 orbital space cities. They also had a large starship construction industry that was a rival to the Corellian shipyards. Their government was centered around their starship corporations, and all political decisions were made by the stockholders of those companies. As one of the earliest species to develop hyperdrives, they were one of the founding races of the Galactic Republic. They colonized a number of planets, and over time, distinct varieties of Duros evolved. The Nemoidian race is one such example. To be clear though, there's currently nothing in canon that specifically says Nemoidians are genetically related to the Duros other than their similar appearance. The average Duro was considered to be adventurous but peaceful. However, some members of the species reveled in violence like Cad Bane, and Duros were not afraid to join a worthy war effort. Many members of the Rebel Alliance hailed from Duro. And that's about all we know about the Duros right now. Are there any other species you'd like to see me cover like this? Let me know in the comments. And check out this playlist of species I've already talked about if you're interested in seeing more. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, and consider checking out my Patreon page. As always, thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.